Hey, I'm Jim Weber in the Fox 13 Weather Center. Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. So throughout the month of September, a large part of the Atlantic is what we're watching as far as tropical development all through the Caribbean, Gulf of Mexico, Western Atlantic, extending all the way out into the Eastern Atlantic. But nearing the end of the month here, heading towards October, we're going to start to narrow that focus of where we look. We're not looking as far out into the Atlantic. So that period of time to see th something developing across the eastern Atlantic, that will be closing pretty quickly here over the coming weeks. So big wide view, what we're watching, we have one tropical wave working its way right through the middle of the Atlantic, uh, right near the uh, intertropical convergence zone that's heading towards the Lesser Antilles. Not a whole lot of development with this, but models showing maybe possibility of some modest development with this over the next five days. So we'll put that 20% chance on this. And then as you look across the northern Atlantic, what we're looking at is a frontal boundary working its way into the Atlantic. We get these lows sometimes, so they hang out long enough. We can actually see something developing, maybe some sort of non-tropical or subtropical system. So that's what we're watching because models are basically indicating something may try and form. Now, as far as those waves down to the south, there's a lot of dry air that's been working its way through the Atlantic heading towards the Caribbean. So everything is just to the south of that dry air. It has to stay just to the south of it or it really has no chance of surviving. So as you look at the GFS, you can watch that one wave working its way towards the Lesser Antilles. At the same time, look across the northern Atlantic and you can see that low just kind of hanging out. And if it can hang out long enough, maybe it'll gain some of those tropical characteristics. So other than that, really not a whole lot going on. We'll keep you updated right here on MyFoxHurricane.com.